See, no plan to. Psoriasis and arthritis and inflammation and um, all kinds of itises and and bacteria infections and viruses. I'll tell you what, the wages of sin is death, and people do um, get sick uh, because of uh, their current relationship with God. Uh, Americans are over medicated. They're over medicated. And when people have illnesses and aches and hurts, in fact, maybe that's a message from God saying that, are you indeed right with me? There's different curses that people indeed get. Now, let me tell you, um, let me look at a, an 80-year-old today with today's modern science. and Today's modern science. And everyone's like, oh, we can't live with health care. They believe that lie. You can't live without health care. But let me remind you that Moses was 80 years old. When he climbed, was at Mount Sinai, grabbed two stone tablets that God inscripted on him, went down the mountain, broke them, and had to climb back up the mountain to get two more to come back down. 80 years old. Now, the wages of sin is death. My uh, my uh, uh, paradigm that I do have that if Jesus was not uh, crucified, he wasn't crucified. That sin causes death. I I do think indeed that if Jesus was not crucified, that he would still be alive today because he didn't sin. He never would sin. And in fact, if he wasn't made to become sin in any of that point, that when you sin, it causes death to cells. It causes some sort of uh, curse, uh, some ailment. But if you never sin, right, you, you live a perfect life, then in fact, death will never know you. So the closer you are to God, the more healthy indeed that you are. Americans are so over medicated and that's because simply they're not right with God. But the pharmaceutical lobby loves that indeed Americans aren't good with God. 